Rates may be deterring buyers from becoming homeowners or moving into a new home. KPLC's Andrea Robinson talks with a local realtor to break down what's happening in the housing market. There's a lot to think about when purchasing a home and real estate agent Danette McManus says it can become very overwhelming for buyers. We can't always depict exactly what's going to happen, but we will tell you that the interest rates, as we all know, have increased. The current mortgage rate for a home in Lake Charles is about 6.4% for a 30 year fixed rate, according to NerdWallet. I mean, just in our five parish area, we still have, uh, you know, plenty of inventory. Um, but you're not dealing with as many repairs needed. Those things have kind of been wrapping up, but at this juncture, it's where do these people go? That's, you know, we can go sell your house, but where are you going to move? So what's it going to take to go from for sale to sold? Well, realtors say that interest rates aren't the only thing that's weighing on buyers. We have increased the interest rates. Then you have the whole insurance crisis going on. McManus explains over 20 insurance companies have pulled out of the state. That uh, requires the owner to then go to a secondary policy, and usually it's citizens, um, which is usually meant for last resort. And with the influx of people needing coverage, insurance rates are high. The price, the property taxes, the homeowner's insurance, the flood policy, all of those things make a big puzzle piece fit together. And if those aren't jiving, then we can have a lot of let down buyers. She says in terms of affordability, there are options you may be able to work through with your home lender, including grants and programs to bring down interest rates. As a buyer, do your due diligence, get with a real estate agent, use their resources and put money aside. That is not going to hurt anything to have extra money in your pocket to have for down payment. In Lake Charles, Andrea Robinson, 7 News. McManus also warns about doing any research online as it may not be indicative to our area. She says it's best to reach out to experts who can guide you through the tricky process of buying a home. Well,